All that work has brought them here. What do they have, Doug? Well, right now, Riv, it looks like they have A, and they have A for free. Hiko's already dropped off, oh, actually, to the Breach utility that we highlighted at the Ooh. beginning of the series. So, a great start here for Haban Liberty. Austin is in a great spot there, but you see they, they're protecting the flanks, right? Like, Plex is in a position where he's going to ensure nobody's coming in from mid. They have full access of sight. This is a difficult retake for 100 Thieves. Quite a bit of utility to still come into the site. Steel's holding most of that. And they're going to start the smokes with Nitro over to A-Main. All right, that's an excellent start. Austin able to get one. Shion's playing just on the other side of smoke. Leads opting to go aggressive. He's able to clean one up as well. As there is just one left, but he's not going to take care of business. Steel drops space. Quick trailblazer to figure out what's on switch and to push through. The oh. use of utility. You were talking about this, Duck. How they flow forward with their utility. Ethan gets that trade. Let's see how Vaughn responds. Austin has got to go big here. Austin is already good for one. Ethan gets one as well as the spike goes down at the hands of Crane. Ten hundred thieves finally retake this site. Heavy numbers advantage oh, their way. Great. Crane, good for one. The Seekers come out as well. Just dances around the generator spike, slowly ticking away. There's a decent amount of util, but look at Ethan. Ethan's only got 46 health. Trailblazer tags. Pleats, good for it. Crane in a way to free. It's doable, but no. Steel gets two to wrap up the round. 100 Thieves are on the board. <sighs> We're seeing that they have not fully lost control of their own spawn. All right, so breather able to be That's had big. by team. Steel's a big open there with a vandal onto Misen. And that's going to be the first blood of this fourth round, where they decide to move. That was actually Seekers coming up on that. Mm -hmm. So we'll have to see how they can use that in the next round. But the round present right now, can they tie it up from 100 Thieves' side? Steel going big. He's already gotten three. And this is a slight difference from 100 Thieves as well. We talked about how they like to play off-site. This time they're stacked on there. And to give up the sound, he, fears, <laughs> no, no, he feels no. like he's got people bearing down on him. Two to two as we head into anything. So they backed off. They're not worried about taking too much if they don't have it. Seekers, Hunter's Fury, and Rolling Thunder have all been dropped as we talked about oh. previously. Havon Liberty looking to get onto the site as 100 Thieves slowly trying to make their way back in. Austin is playing up top. Havon Liberty have gotten in there. The Rez is going to come through for Seal, so he's back online. 13 seconds left. Shion should be able to get the spike down. 100 Thieves again find themselves in a retake situation. 4v4 as they make their way in. Good utility here for Shion. The rest of the team, they have quite a few flashes to give back here to the side of 100 Thieves and Steel as a squad is healthy as they look to make their way in. War waging in tree. It's Crane slowly playing around. Crane has a chance to blow this up if he gets the, the flame. right, but it might be Liazzi. Oh. He gets one, Crane gets one as well. Oh. Liazzi gets the second, but Hiko! My goodness, Hiko! He gets the last kill and he gets the defuse to take a two round lead. Back and presume uh, four rounds in a row, presumably five given the gun difference and Asuna the kill. Go for it one more time as he takes a quick fall line to the face. That's Lianzi coming in. And that's going to be a nice shot. One from Steel and Asuna. Doug, they continue to make this happen in a split second. All sorts of information. And well, and really, honestly, Lianzi was able to upgrade a weapon, but it, it's been a lot of rinse and repeat. Yeah. Right? Like, as much as we talked about how we like that they feel things out and then they make a move, we find ourselves on the same site for the seventh round in a row, if yep. I'm not mistaken. Right? Like, it might look a little different at the beginning, but... 100 Thieves to the bone. Oh, that may just be for info, surely. Okay, he does not take it. He pulls back. As you see on your minimap, they've actually gotten great positioning around the members of 100 Thieves. They have mid control, but they're going to have to get by Asuna. And yeah, he is going to be able to drop, but he got one on the way out. But that should open the door for Havan Liberty. Nitro playing backside, playing by himself. He has a little bit of info from the Sova oh my Intel. God. And my gosh, he's not even going to get a chance, right? It's just on to Plex. He just hurt. This control Havan always get of mid is so perfect. Yeah, but it hasn't it hasn't amounted oh. in anything. I think that's the problem, right? And 100 Thieves have no incentive to change that, right? Like, sure, let's keep giving a mid if we yeah. know that we can lose that and still have control of the map. It does seem like they're okay with the firefight right. within the site. The spike is down. It almost seems like 100 Thieves, is, they don't love that position, but they are thriving at that play currently. A few more Hunter's Furies towards Cat there. Meeson goes down, but they have the Nitro as they trade one back. Oh, Steel's about to have a lot of split. No, the timing may be right, but he narrowly misses the shot. He had two members just on the other side. Hiku's going to have oh, a hit to doing boy. the same. The timing is right here, though. Not able to get the, the second one. Steel drops as well. Wow. That's the round that Havan Liberty get back. Quick Trailblazer down. Let the thunder roll. Looks like they want A. And there's a good push by Liazzi. Does he get any kills? Oh boy, this is a tough spot now. This is, That's the space that 100 Thieves have shown they're not okay with giving up. And they will fight for that tooth and nail. And it seems to work out for 100 Thieves as they've already gotten two. Steel's going to use his ult as the secrets have been used as well. Hunting down the remaining members of Havan Liberty. Just three left. The spike did go down. But Steel just delayed by the gravity one. Not able to get through.
4v3. They've attacked in a death ball with maybe one flank if the timing was right. Oh, Mason takes one down, grenade. but it's a double trade for that one. Plats alone in 1v3. His position been given away as well. Ooh. He's gonna get cleaned up at the hands of Hiko. It's just 100 Thieves seem to have their number on most of the executes that are coming in. Oh. Asuna again. On to Plats, that's the shot. Call. Got in mid control again, but because he recalled the star, instead of keeping it as a smoke, Asuna is able to land that shot. And the little bit of space that 100 Thieves seem comfortable giving away, they can't even get that. Fault line in five seconds. Looks like something they could be waiting for. That's going to go up towards tree, but they're peeking before the util goes out. Yep. Yep. Asuna taking full advantage of that. Shion now drops Asuna, and now we have a 4v3 coming into the site. And a big rotation. It's just 9 3 first half. Yeah. Again, Leazi, like, <laughs> way, way out. Uh, in Doing a little Cirque Soleil. <laughs> Get pushed back. That's a no no. Yep. He is going to get away. He is going to preserve his life. Steel's going to get a good bit of info. My goodness, they know that they're coming through. Right here. His face taken away. But Steel's going to drop. Austin is able to get one. As equalize, numbers equalize at four. Havan not giving up. They drop a little bit more util, but they are going to rotate. But Nitro's in a great spot. My guy. Going to pinch out from bench here. The team said audio was cut. You saw the rotation quick back from Ethan. He got right back to yep. A. 100 Thieves is not trying to over-rotate on this. And a very tense 4v4 here with one minute left on for our last round of the first half. Spike is going to start to trend towards the B site. This is an interesting split for Haban Liberty as well because you saw they've got Crane taking the scenic route, right? Like he's going all the way around. It's going to take a while for him to really make his presence known on that half of the map. And that's kind of what I'm expecting to see, right? Like draw some attention over to A, then hit B. They've been, they've been known to do it. And actually, they're, they're fakes. The times that we've seen them uh, in, yeah. in the Brazilian... Uh, region have been pretty good. Nitro will have left. the smoke back up again, timing that to cover <gasps> off B. Oh, oh no! I didn't think he was gonna step all the way out. I thought they were just gonna play cat and mouse forever, Doug. Oh my word. Austin is still in a great spot though, right? He's still got the he's actually looking to go in aggressive. He's got the blade storm, he's going up. 13 seconds left, but on Liberty, they're gonna have to go. They're running out of time. What can left. 100 Thieves do for the hold off? No, for one, not able to get the second. Oh, he's gonna drop. Hiko's gonna drop as well. The round's gonna fall into Ethan's hands. This spike's not gonna go down though. Same outcome. And they are getting verbal about it. Like we said, if you watch the uh, press conference, Steel says this. Uh, it, Brings him alive. Yeah. This locks him yep. in. Ozzy straight out of the aggression from Havon Liberty. He was able to get one, but they've taken full mid control. A's been left open. Plants is left alone. Asuna's going to be able to clean him up, so they're going to be able to get on to A. And much like we saw in the previous half, it's going to be a fight what? for A retake. Steel dropping a bit of util to kind of keep space away. Liazzi's going to take care of Ethan. As Asuna slowly creeping his way forward. A 3v3. Asuna's gonna get cleaned up. Steals there for the trade! Able oh to get the God. second what? as well. As my, as Meeson, excuse me, is left alone. Ballsy peaks coming in from both teams here to make sure they can get the round in their favor. A quick go! Oh my word! Steal with the 3k. I thought that was gonna be a blind on both. Liberty, they drop the paranoia. Asuna and Steel are gonna be the tip of the spear as they work their way forward. Asuna's gonna get that shot as well. Just leaving one player back. Oh, Crane. Crane is good for it. But he's gonna get cleaned up. The Guardian, no less. Cleaning things up and getting 100 Thieves onto the site. The Spike should be able to get down as well. You, I also love Nitro playing the middle of the map, right? He's not going to play on site with them. He goes in a great spot as well. I love this setup from 100 Thieves. A lot of util here for Plex. Calling the shots for the team. They follow the leader in with confidence. Can this be a 3v4 yeah. that Havan Liberty can come back with? Already back yeah. off on this one. Not confident about what they can bring in, but if they have two more players on the next round, they may try to do something. And I think this is too much reserve play in their favor. Yeah, hmm. you're, you're looking for the win, but I think you are allowing so much agency to 100 Thieves that they are walking all over you eventually. Yeah, and, and it Out really, when you've still got this much left in the round, saving just becomes so much more difficult. And right, they they're going hunting. Yeah, uh, and <laughs> they try. They're not able to get anything financially going into the next round, yeah. staring at match point, try to save what you can and maybe make something yeah. happen. But you're right, Ed, like, you're playing not to lose. And that's hard. That's what I want to say. Bad teams showing how strong they are with dominant performances throughout the day. Oh, 100 Thieves are going, and they're going to go full send. They use the ults, it flashes. They use a little bit of everything to get on to B, and they're going to do so with almost no resistance. Yeah. They were able to drop one member of Havan Liberty, but that, that's, that's all that was there. It's a, And it's a consideration of 
what can 100 Thieves do in a round, you yeah. know? To be yeah. turned around and just running away there. Havan was not ready for the situation. 100 Thieves seems to be able to vary up whatever they're doing to throw Havan Liberty for a loop. Final round, Doug, of the first map. It looks like it could be 100 Thieves. Oh, Asuna getting a little bit of friendly fire on the flash, and then the fall line, he's getting all sorts of messed up. The Ozzy was able to one Asuna getting pushed back, he's gonna drop, but Nitro's in a great spot to flip things. They still have a couple of members in the back of the side as well, as Nitro repositions, gets into an attacker spawn. Time ticking away, Crane's gonna have to make some men earlier. Um, <laughs> but it, it is, and it gets tough because when results don't 410, you've got to get on to site proper to make something happen. And the problem is you've got Asuna on the Reina there and she does not give up an inch. And it looks like she wants to go hunting for more. She goes up top, able to get the second one, looking for the third. Oh, Deny him up and knock him down, baby. Asuna pick it up right where he left oh, off. Oh, he's on his rope. He's on his rope. Oh my okay, word, okay. Hiko finds 5 HP. He said, now it's your turn. <laughs> now it's your turn. Steel's going to take that one. with Work their way up to leaning towards B. You've got a couple on long, and they've taken some of the space away. Nitro was in a good spot, but Asuna cleans up Let's already. This is a brutal spot for Havan Liberty, right? Like, they're being pinched in around. Yes, Asuna was able to clear out, but Seal's gonna follow up right where he left off. They are stuck right now, and there's nowhere to go. They suffocate their opponents. Yeah. 100 Thieves are dominating Havan right now. And for those moments on the mini-map, you can see him peeking back and forth. They're gaining a bit of ground, but as the fight continues on it. And they've actually mid-round swapped the op. Now dropped. All right, that was just pacing. It was like the hockey stick being down. He couldn't grab it right away. Meeson takes down Nitro. How do they play this? This is where Havan needs to feel out how 100 Thieves is working, because yep. this round can play mentally into many rounds that 100 or Havan Liberty can use if they figure out how 100 Thieves starts to move here a man yeah. down. So this is really the first bit of space they've gotten really yeah. anywhere across the map, right? Like, they have B long between. control, now they have A control, they're able to get the spike down, the walls up, and you take a look at Meeson, right? He's rotating, so keep an eye on him on the minimap, he's gonna rotate all the way around, has a chance to blow this up, and this is the type of play Play. This is the type of round that can really shift momentum. It's got to be big out of him, though. They're using the utility on site. Meeson's going to get those calls. Oh, the shots no. are fired, and now he only creates pressure. 100 Thieves know they can go harder in the yep. site now. Yep. And he wasn't able to get the kill. Yeah, now, oh, he got dropped. She very similar defensive setup for 100 Thieves. Oh, there you go. But very patient here, trying to see if 100 Thieves are going to play a bit aggressively. They have shown a propensity to do that between the, pre the last map and this one. So they're going to wait things out, oh, and oh, Ethan oh. got so much information, and he's good for one. Drops down, finds the second one as well. Playing peekaboo over here. Saw him a few times. Changes place, double TP with a fake one on top of that. And now with a minute left, there's a lot of time for Havon Liberty to play this out slow. Where can they grab an operator shot? Shion now, full utility up front, and Havon Liberty loves using that drone to move forward. Here we go. Nitro did drop out for info. That's Havon Liberty slowly creep forward. Their leader's gonna drop Ethan. Gonna be in a world of hurt as yeah, Meeson's able to clean him up. They get control of A. They are gonna be able to get onto the site, but this is still going to be a bit of a difficult situation here. They do have the numbers advantage, but Seal does have his ult. He's gotta stay alive though to make it work. Asuna is gonna be able to equalize things as far as numbers go as he's looking for more. Yep, lines up, gets a second one as well. Numbers advantage tipping in favor of 100 Thieves, but they're all so weak. Right, nobody has any armor. Seal has three health, but he's going in aggressive. He's gonna get cleaned up. Asuna, good for two. Liazi trades him out. Nitro in the 1v1. He's got a Venom. Liazi on the tab. Oh Liazi gosh. doesn't get it. Nitro swings, gives him the business and the defuse as 100 Thieves get to five. And what a defense there from Haven. Liber oh, have on. Nitro, and that's much easier said than done, but here we go. The Empress comes online. Asuna drops it instantly. Here comes the Viper's Pit as well. Can they, were they going to have better success with that? No, it's actually the Blade Storm that gets a little something going for them. Tied up 4-4. Nicely done. Creeping in there. You have to take those fights. You cannot be afraid to do it. And that is going to be the Ozzy that's feeling good about the pressure. Moving forward, Ethan hesitating for a second, but knows the, the movement and direction of most of the members now of Avon Liberty as he saw a few more there on yellow. They're gonna have to take the fight to them and keep an eye on the minimap. Platz is on the flank, and if this delays long enough, this is gonna be a serious problem. The Killjoy ult's coming out. It's gonna be countered by Crane's ultimate, and that's gonna destroy it. So that's offline. Mies is still playing in his smoke, in his ult, and he's able to get two. He go able to trade it out, however, as Meeson's already good for three. There's just one remaining on the Big side round. of 100 Thieves. Nothing doing. Hiko, excuse Thank me. Thank you very much. But that is gonna come online. So A, 
Rib A is, is not that it has been much of an option Ooh. previously. Your sign, right? Like that should be the cue that something's coming, and that op shot certainly is going to help as steel drops. And they're going to have to rotate over. Hundred thieves aren't there. My word. Just got to mention how scary that was. Plus, just stood out here and used a wall. What a madman. He's got cake, right? Like what you've got if you're yeah. Avon Liberty is you've got. They're going to challenge. Oh, he and he's been tagged up. 48 health, so B, B long is now not, not an option, right? Like, yeah. in the previous round, A was where they felt the pressure. Now they're feeling the pressure from B. Yeah, they're going to bring Meeson back up, but they know where the space is, right? Like, they know where the action is right now. That's a big kill from Shion as he's all the way into the belly of the beast right now. And this was kind of a, a previous round where they gained information. Remember, Shion was working yes. that tube yeah. into Kitchen, understanding how they might play it. Mid-round, Ethan! Oh, my word, the collapse coming through. And will it be Nitro to finish it off, Doug? Nitro tagged up a couple. Asuna was there as well. Proverbial pants Ooh, down as close. he gets seeing some of that build. You're seeing some changes, but for 100 Thieves, they feel the pressure. Havan Liberty has won four of the last five. last couple of rounds. It means they like to go away, and it's because of that that Asuna's already back in their spawn, and it was oh. all off of that wall hit. He's got to get the info. He's got to get the kill here, and if you're if you're Havan Liberty, you cannot leave Asuna to wreak havoc on your back line. This is a really big kill, but no, Asuna comes away victorious. Yes, the spike is down, but again, they're pinched in. They've got nowhere to go, and Asuna's oh, doing things like that. Oh, the been cleaned up. Asuna good for three. The Empress comes online. Nitro gets the last. Hundred Thieves get to set. Oh, good start. It's an excellent start. Forward maze area. Okay. Almost a okay. peak. Might have seen a knee, and he does the hip shot on the Ozzy. And they've got the Viper's Pet online on A now, right? So, again... It, it's not that they can't go there, but it's just so damn difficult to work your way through that they have to rotate off. Ethan's going to get excellent info, too, with 30 oh, seconds Ethan. left that he's got one, and he's got the spike, spike right? So they're, he's at, they're in a great spot. Hegel's going to be wrapping around them as well as he gets the timing right. One, two, there it is. He's able to land the shot. Pletz is left alone. The round fell apart because of the positioning that 100 Thieves had at the beginning of the round, Asuna notwithstanding, right? Like, they, they, they read him, right? Like, they played him like a fiddle. But the rest of it was so well played by 100 Thieves that Havan Liberty, the, the round was lost before they knew it. Yeah. That deja vu, uh, he go for two. It's momentum. They got a long way to go. They got to surpass the eight rounds, 100 Thieves, and keep it rolling. Well, they do have a long way to go. They're giving Asuna. That's a good start. Yep, they're giving Asuna and 100 oh! Thieves a bit of their own medicine. Shion okay. showing anything you can do, I can do better. He opens up. He's able to get two. Now they've got so much room to work with on A, right? 100 Thieves have to back up. That's not safe. You've also got a little bit of presence towards B Long and coming out of Meeson. Get out of That's here. That's big. That area, just like Reyna's playground, you get to dismiss, you got so many corners to play yep. with, and Shion knows how to use it very, very well with the Ghost. A third one of the round, looking for a possible ace, that's the fourth, Doug. Can he sink the last shot on Hiko? 35 health. Tell me he's gonna no. just Indiana Jones this. Oh! Oh, he spotted him. Jig is up. He was like running for his life. <laughs> Get me out of here as soon as you can. Meeson's flanking around as well, but are they even going to give him the pleasure to get that last kill? Shion looking for it, dancing around it. Somebody give it to him. Uh, no, Pletz. bad guy Pletz takes the ace away. <laughs> oh, Liazi was he's in a great spot again to make something happen. They're using the drone as contact. Not going to get anything going. Shion, or excuse me, not Shion. Uh, Pletz is going to get the wall up and get the kill, but he gets dropped. Pushing through the Viper Bite. A little audacious there by Shion, but I like the play. And 100 Thieves are going to find the bonus round. Not too much of a problem here by Havan Liberty. This is a huge round if they're able to grab it with that less eco. Thieves really right, like understand. There's not a lot of room to work with. Cut. Oh my gosh, Ethan swings around the corner. Left, right, good night. An op shot to the face takes him down. Not able to land the second. As Liazzi has to back up. Oh man, <laughs> just forget it. Shion's gonna get in on the action as well. Is there only two members remaining from 100 Thieves? Asuna, he's got something cooking. He saw it, he saw it, yep. Just the edge of the weaponry there on the uh, doorway. Asuna pushing forward, and that's gonna be a shot from Meeson to take him down. 1v2 for Hiko, 15 HP. How many times has Hiko been in situations he's like shot this? Guards, my man situations just like this in a 1vx low health he's got some utility and he makes magic happen once again this time on the international stage does he have it in him does that gene work here in berlin you've got the two members of Havan liberty creeping their way forward he goes good for one the 1v1 he's gonna get info the tap's not there he hasn't even gotten it to have he goes oh, oh, lands it baby 
Mercedes Spencer Martin does it again, a Red Bull! There, that should be everything, uh, all that they've been able to deduce, so you don't know there's a ton over at B, and yeah, I think because of that, oh. very well played, they're going to rotate off. He heard the drone! <gasps> he heard the drone! No. Oh, what a rat! No. What a rat, Steel playing super smart. Yeah, Ethan ulted, cancelled out, Steel's able to get one, Ethan's able to get the Lurker as well. So now Ethan's in a spot where he can blow up the middle of the map on the rotate and- My word. The Aussie trying to get a move onto that, Steel's gonna get taken down as it just goes back and forth right quick. And now it's Pletz to do what he can in the kitchen here. Ethan will find the hat trick on the round. Oh my word, they are just seeking out Hovan Liberty and taking them down as quick as possible once they get the lead in these games. 100 Thieves will figure out how to route that strategy. Now coming oh in, three gosh, ultimates here on defense. The one's going to get dropped here with Hunter's Fury. Does it pick anything up as Steel opens up the round? Dude, they're going so fast. Oh my Look God. at how deep it is. Austin is. Of course, he dies as I call him out, but they got in through the Hunter's Fury. Or excuse me, Hiko still has that Hunter's Fury, but the ults are all there. They're able to get the Viper spit down. Austin was like running at them in their spawn, and now Liazzi's dropped as well. 100 Thieves looking to put the Finishing blow on this thing. They wanted to hit him hard. That's exactly what they've done. Now Hiko's going to use his Hunter's Fury. Not getting anything going quite yet, but Steel does as it's just down to Crane. The Guardian, no magic habit. Match point, series point for 100 Thieves here as they've really been able to best. Oh.